AstraZeneca vaccine could be banned for young Britons, with the Medicines and Healthcare Products Regulatory Agency, MHRA, investigating rare blood clots experienced by those receiving the jab. Channel 4 News said in its report on Monday evening, two senior sources have told this program that while the data is still unclear there are growing arguments to justify offering younger people, below the age of 30 at the very least, a different vaccine. The channel claimed an announcement from the MHRA could be made later today. The MHRA has released a statement confirming it is investigating the blood clots but added no decision had, yet, been taken on changing its advice. Our thorough and detailed review is ongoing into reports of very rare and specific types of blood clots with low platelets following the COVID-19 vaccine AstraZeneca. No decision has yet been made on any regulatory action. Downing Street has continued to insist the AstraZeneca vaccine is safe and effective, and that people should continue to accept the jab when they are called forward. A UK government spokesperson said, the Oxford AstraZeneca vaccine is safe, effective and has already saved thousands of lives in this country. As the UK's independent regulator has said, when people are called forward, they should get the jab. The MHRA conducted a review of the AstraZeneca vaccine last week and said there was currently no evidence to suggest a causal link between blood clots and the jab. The regulator also insisted the benefits of the vaccine in preventing coronavirus outweigh any possible risks. It noted that 30 of the 18.1 million people who had been vaccinated against Oxford in the UK developed blood clots. In an interview with the Italian newspaper, Marco Cavallari, the head. The vaccine strategy, at the European Pharmaceutical Authority, EMA, says there is a link between the AstraZeneca vaccine and the rare cases of blood clotting reported in people who received the drug recently. Mr. Cavallari also noted there was a higher than expected number of cases of cerebral thrombosis, blood clotting in the brain, among younger people vaccinated compared with the general population. Epidemiologist Professor Neil Ferguson also told BBC Radio Fawes Today program, in terms of the data at the moment, there is increasing evidence that there is a rare risk associated, particularly with the AstraZeneca vaccine but it may be associated at a lower level with other vaccines, of these unusual blood clots with low platelet counts. 